In this example, I just wanted to show you how proving a trig identity can look so different. So this looks completely different to uh, the previous example in the previous video, um, such that the likelihood of you being able to do this from scratch is going to be quite unlikely. So they do need practice. So we've got tan theta sine theta is equal to 1 over cos theta minus cos theta. We do have some options here. Um, we could, like we did in the first example from the previous video, work from the left-hand side and show that it's equal to the right-hand side. Um, that can be quite tricky in this example. Um, you could work um, with the right-hand side and show it's equal to the left-hand side. Okay, that might be a little bit better, might be a little bit easier. But the way that I'm going to do it is I'm going to work with both sides simultaneously. Okay, so I'm going to work first of all with this tan theta. I'm going to replace the tan theta with sine theta cos theta. Well, sine theta over cos theta rather. So I've got sine over cos times sine is the same as 1 over cos minus cos. Okay. Well, if I um, look at the left-hand side, then that is the same as sine squared theta over cos theta, which is 1 over cos theta minus cos theta. So that's the left-hand side as it stands. Now, if I multiply through by cos theta, both sides, sine squared theta over cos theta will just become sine squared theta. 1 over cos theta multiplied by cos theta is 1, and cos theta times cos theta is cos squared theta. So you should see where we're at now. Adding cos squared theta to both sides... we arrive at sine squared plus cos squared equals 1, as required. So I've shown that this is just a rearrangement of sine squared plus cos squared equals 1. And so the left-hand side is equal to the right-hand side. Um, so there are trickier ways of showing this proof. Um, and it's probably very good practice to try different methods to see if you can work your way around it. I'd probably try with showing that the right-hand side is equal to the left-hand side. Um, if you, and my hint to you on that would be to write the right-hand side as, oh, sorry, as this, and then combine those two fractions by doing cross-multiplication. So 1 times 1 is 1, cos theta times cos theta is minus cos squared theta, and then you've got cos theta over 1. So start with writing the right-hand side as that, and then see if you can get tan theta sine theta.